Hi everyone, it is an absolutely splendid day for football and we're looking forward to the game. My name is Derek Ray, with me in the commentary position is the former Arsenal and England defender Lee Dixon and very much looking forward to bringing you live action from Ligue 2 BKT. It's Socho and they face Paris FC. Yeah, thank you Derek, looking forward to today, you'll be in for a good game. Let's hope we see a quick start from both teams, set the tempo for the rest of the match. Joseph Lopi, le numéro 4, Abdalando, le numéro 20, Younes Kabouni, le numéro 6, Hussein Oudion, le numéro 10. So the initial 11 for the home side. Pretty well balanced this formation, Lee. Yeah, it can be a 4 2 3 1 in the offensive mode, but it can also go back to a 4 5 1 when you're defending. The lone striker will be supported by the three just behind him, especially the number 10 who will be given a free roll. This is the lineup for the visitors today. Well, as a team, they do have their stylistic preference, and it really is all about trying to put the opposition under pressure, making sure that they don't compose themselves. Lee, do you expect to see more of that in this game? Yeah, pretty much. They love to press high, don't they? It's their preferred style of play, winning the ball high up the pitch. It certainly benefits their strikers. They're very good at it. And they kick off here. Lopi. On the ball, endure. Chris Bedia. Monduki, Gakpa, Anna, in position here to protect, Anna, Julian Lopez, and teammates to play it to, can they forge ahead? What a vital intervention. Opportunity here. And the keeper showing tremendous command. Now the delivery. Abdi. Another sitting ever deeper. And they'll get ready for the throw in. Abdallah Indur. Chris Bedia. Usainu Tiun. Well, pass after pass, maybe they can chisel an opportunity. And space for the cross. And cleared away. Bedia. Passing it around, looking for the goal that would put them ahead.
Moving the ball effectively, looking for the right moment. Space and time for the cross. Well, the clearance half-hearted. A really top-notch piece of defending. Monduki. Space afforded him. Monduki. Well, body in the way. Strong play here. Can he find the angle? And no butterfinger tendencies from the goalkeeper. When you look at those stats, Derek, it tells a story all of its own. They haven't created enough chances. The forwards have been off the game as well. They haven't really utilised the wide areas for me, but they should go on and win the game, to be honest. Now can they make something happen? Read it magnificently and intercepted. And he's made headway. Surely. And thumped away. And he's fired over the corner. And there it is, the half-time whistle. Plenty to consider based on what we've seen so far as the second half begins. Gakpa. Monduki. Conte. Gakpa. Couldn't hang on to it. Well, that's a super ball over the top. Just cleared away in the nick of time. Had a chance to whip it in here. Kuhn. Well, he likes to run at them. And a tidy challenge. Conte. Bamba. Gakpa. Monduki. Happy to pass the ball, but remaining patient. Lost possession. Pogba. And intercepted it. Monduki. Moving the ball forward with purpose. Excellent defending. A good effective pressure high up the pitch. Usainu Tune. Well, it's come down to the final 20 minutes here. Still passing it around with authority. In possession to give them the lead, maybe. 
And a strong glove on the ball from the keeper. Another successful intervention, winning the ball back. Well, it's deadlock. Could be a mistake, could be a moment of magic. Surely someone will take this game by the scruff of the neck. Couldn't keep it. Anna. Lopez. Monduki. Gakpa. Only ten minutes remaining here. Still pushing for what could be a winner. Chris Bedia. Abdallah Endur. Under pressure. Doesn't seem to be bothering him. Plenty of players waiting in the middle. Bedia. This looks promising. And they know they need to stop him. Chris Bedia. Hewn. That's a good looking ball. And with that, the 90 minutes have come to an end, an even contest.